An important part of Hinsdale Humane Society's goal of increasing annual adoptions is educating people about positive dog training methods, techniques, and enrichment practices, which in turn promote a strong, positive bond between people and their pets, while improving the likelihood of finding pets a forever home. At the Tuthill Family Pet Rescue and Resource Center, operated by Hinsdale Humane Society, dog training classes are conducted using positive training methods to promote humane pet treatment and responsible pet care, as well as helping people bond with their pets. We have puppy classes, we have adult dog classes, which we call the family dog class. We have an intermediate advanced class, which is called Beyond the Basics, and we've also added a therapy dog class. This is my dog, Eddie. And Eddie is an alumni of Hinsdale Humane Society. I adopted him about a year and a half ago. I decided to enroll Eddie in the HHS training program. I wanted a supportive, friendly, caring environment for him to go through basic training. Eddie did very well in the training class. He learned basic commands, he learned his name, he even learned a few tricks. He did so well in the training class that I was able to enroll him in Hinsdale's Therapaws pet therapy program because he was so responsive to the commands and he paid very good attention so I knew he would be a good therapy dog. We do take the dogs that are from the community also. We don't only accept dogs who have been adopted from us. We do private lessons if you're not sure if your dog will do well in a group dog setting. Enrichment activities are important to shelter animals to help them gain the confidence and trust needed to be successful in their forever homes. A lack of enrichment in a pet's environment can lower immune systems and lead to behavioral issues and neurological degeneration. We have a cat superhighway in the cat room, so they're kind of up high so they can run around. We also have a catio in there so they can get some fresh air but they're safely secured. We also, when the adoption councils are in there, they have free roam for the ones that want some friends so they can get some activity and enrichment that way. Dogs are social animals, so they do well interacting with each other, so it helps them mentally and also gets some of that physical energy out. We have frisbees we put peanut butter on and they're kind of in the back of their cage, so they have to work to get that off. Sometimes we have them at the front desk, so they're interacting with the public, they're getting some out time there. The main difference between enrichment activities and training Especially with the dogs, it allows them to be themselves. Just as people, they have their own personalities. Enrichment, we find, is very important for the animals here. We need to keep them not only physically healthy, but we want to keep them mentally healthy so that they can be here and be happy. And then once they're happy, it's easier to be more adoptable. And then once we help them be more adoptable, then they can stay in their forever homes, which is our main goal here. Our Behavior Helpline offers free answers to questions about dog or cat behavior. One of our knowledgeable staff members will return your message within 48 hours with suggestions on resolving basic behavior issues and recommendations on where to go for help with more complex issues. I would definitely recommend Hinsdale Humane Society's training programs to anyone. They are very supportive, very kind, and the trainers here really love dogs. You can tell that by the way that they handle each individual dog in the classes. The classes are small, they're not threatening, and they do everything they can to make the dog succeed. For more information and details about our dog training classes, please visit our website or call us at 630-323-5630.